Well, good evening. Now, uh, of course, at 6 p.m., uh, John and Haley launched a one day special and it was incredibly busy. And I'm not surprised because we are talking about, well, John himself, but also craft artist Mike Magic. So, John, that hour was incredibly busy. It was far busier than I, I expected. Yes. I, I know Mike Magic has always been busy when we've brought it. Um, and we always end up bringing basically almost just once yeah. for each sort of set that we've done. But I wasn't expecting it to be so busy. I mean, I'm going to say this, and I suppose I'm expected to say it. Of all the palettes we've done, these are my favourites. You know what? I, I think I'm with you. Yeah, the colour mix it's just of the beautiful. two is just so nice. When I bring mine in, you, you've almost got you've got your primaries in there. Yeah. But you've also got all the different shades and everything. And the fact that they've got the mica in there and the shine, the fact you can use them on so many different things, it's it's just amazing. So I, I was very surprised. But they are. I think it's a wonderful product. I think it's something completely different. And the fact that you can use that with resin yeah. to get things like that or to get something like Absolutely. that yeah to literally to be able to just pour put it into a mold pour resin in and get that it to me it is, is amazing Absolutely, it is. Now, of course, you are. We are talking about Mike and Magic. Uh, now, the one day special has got three pounds uh, off. Now, the, each of this palette should be fourteen pounds and ninety nine pence, as you can see at the bottom of the screen. If you want to buy just a single one, you can, of by all means. But the one day special, you are getting both of them uh, with that saving of three pounds. Now, they will work it out at thirteen pounds and uh, forty nine pence per palette. So you have got that three pounds saving there. However, uh, you are, you are, we have got also a complete collection which includes the box with the dovers in there, which I adore because they come out like it's so much easier to hold there. The dovers, it contains 40, uh, 40 dovers on the case. Now, they are worth uh, in the sales at 19 pounds and 99 pence. Now, if you take that off the price, the palace they're working out at 11 pounds and 24 pence so saving the savings are carried over within the one that so basically in your saving when you go for this bundle is a seven pounds and 50 pence and this is why the hefty stock that we in John brought us uh, has now half the stock in just one single hour. Now, the uh, one day special in itself has been uh, very busy as well, which is just the Mica Magic, those beautiful new palettes with 40% of the stock already gone for that. So if you want to have the brand new beautiful colors, do make sure to check out your mask. Maybe you are just tuning in and you haven't seen Mica Magic before. Now, John, why would you, how you could explain that they, how they work? The, the easiest way that I can explain them is, is just to explain what they are and then what we can do. So basically, the easiest thing is you've got here 30 individual colours yeah. and you've got 30 colours of pigment and mica and a binder. Yeah. So the difference is that basically I can go for this goldy colour here, yeah. put some on my finger and just go straight onto card and colour that card. All right. So I can go straight on. It's easier to show you, actually, we're showing you with the white. It's always easier to show yeah. with white to start with because I forgot about all the overhead. <laughs> I forgot and what it's uh, like. But you're getting that colour straight away. So if I go into the pink, yeah. you'll see how you're instantly getting that, how you're instantly getting the yellow. So in here, it feels like a cream. Right. Can you see there how it's yeah. gilded in yellow, my finger? Okay. If I go in with a brush, it goes powdery. Okay. So it's a powder, but it has a binder in it. So that now is permanent on that oh, card. On that card. So you get that shine. So effectively you've got, it's almost an ink. Yeah. It's almost a gilding wax. Yeah. It's almost a gilding polish. If we take something that's say, but the thing is because it's got mica in it. Right, yeah. It means that it's permanent and works straight away on every surface. I did this in the eight o'clock show. This is MDF. Right. So that's a piece of MDF. Yes. Yeah, with no gesso, no priming, nothing. Raw mm. MDF. Let's take that yellow again, look. Wow. You don't have to do any priming, gesso, basis, anything. It works instantly onto any non... Any basically almost fully, almost porous surface yeah. or porous surface. Yeah. The only thing it doesn't ever go straight onto yeah. to be honest yeah. is glass right 
So but if, yeah, but could you coat it with a kind of gel medium or fixative? You can mix it in with gel medium. You oh. can put it on top of gel wow. medium. It sticks straight onto that. So this is one of the, so that's straight onto MDF. Wow, yeah. No gemos wow. or anything, but this. So very easy to apply. Then that's resin. That's resin straight into the mold, then resin poured on top. Wow. And it stays exactly, none of it moves. Or, this is one of my favourite pieces. People have been asking for months how yes. I did this. Yeah. The test piece. This is oh. one of the Zuri moulds. I love that one. Now, this I basically coated in black gesso, yeah. but I'm going to show you in yeah. a demo in a little bit that you don't have to. And then every bit of this is my magic. Wow. Every bit. So I can go, I'd like a little bit more verdigris, say up here. I'll go with a green yeah. on my finger. I see. So I can verdigree that. Oh, I want it back to gold. They yeah. work on top of each other. So effectively, by doing this, so that's the space. That's yeah. what it takes up. Yeah. That was not so much at all. There's 15 gilding waxes yes. open. There's 30. 30. So it saves you not only ta money, but also time. Yeah, because you imagine what, how long it would take me to unscrew oh my 30 goodness. pots I and the, everything. I love the will to live for, yeah. for those ones. And by the way, if you want to see them, all those beautiful colours, uh, they are here. You can see them all. Uh, we are talking about incredible colours that will work also on resin. And there is this technique that uh, John explained at uh, 6 p.m. But you have got in here. Look, I also love the Micah Magic on both the white and the black because there is a, a distinctive difference. There is. What you've got is the in on the black, the mica creates a coating making the pigments shown. So if you think about it, if you put green ink onto black card, what do you get? Yeah. You get black. Absolutely. The mica magic with the mica in it, you get a different shade. So you look at that pink, it's so different on the black than it is on the white. Yeah. The same with that warm gold, different on the white to the black. Same with the silvers, you're getting a different shade each time, but every single colour works on black or white. Absolutely. Which means it works on any colour of card at all. Indeed it is. And then, of course, we have got dust colours, but then we have got the other palette this as well. This is my favourite. Oh, it's just so <laughs> pretty, pretty, pretty. But again, there's softness. And also, I was watching a bit of the previous, uh, the 6pm as well, and it was a very good point saying, um, you know, sometimes if you have to pay a gilding wax, I don't know how much a gilding wax is these days, but a part is, it's, it's, it's quite a substantial amount, I did, you know, about yeah. £10 or something like that. Now, I wouldn't buy a blue colour because I know that I will use it once no. or twice. However, if it's in a palette of pastels, I know I will use them. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I don't want to knock it. I think I got three for on here for 16 or £17 yeah. pounds of a particular brand yeah. of them. Absolutely brilliant, but it's very gloopy. It's very yeah. liquid. I end up putting it on with a brush. Yeah. This just works so much easier. And as you said, I wouldn't buy a teal, I wouldn't buy a blue. But you like to have that. I wouldn't have five different shades of green. Absolutely. But I want those to use yeah. because that's how I can really build something and up. And also the other thing is that this is more of a pearlescent look rather than a metallic look in a way. It so is. So it's a little bit more like a pearl. It just has got <coughs> that kind of, it's like rounded, pearl, beautiful pearls. I just, I think there is a sophistication to these. Th there colors. really is. I mean, there's a piece I did a little bit earlier, which I'm going to, oh no, I'm not going to find here. So this is a piece of resin which is effectively plastic. But if I show you if I show you on the overhead, you probably see it a little bit better. But if you look at that, look at that sheen and that shine. But look, oh, yeah. there is yeah. no that That's won't wash off. Well, yeah. That won't clean off. But there's none of that gloopy wax build yeah. up. And I've built layer after layer. If you watched the show, you saw me putting lots and lots on. But I can still go in now and go, do you know what? I'd like that to be a little bit blue highlight there. So I'm going to add it. But suddenly, yeah. I've changed the colour. Now oh. it's got the blue on it. Just move that so you can see that. But again, no build-up. Yeah. No waxy sort of left piece over. Every single mm. bit of it is literally just shining. I'm going to hold that there so you can see. Oh, look at that. Now, the one day special is just the two palettes are there. And of course, that means that you can have the two palettes. 737-300 uh, is your item number. You have got a three pound saving. Nearly half the stock has gone in there. And I love, I'm going to show you a couple of samples because I think when you look at this, look at this. Now, you can go for the complete bundle, which is very busy as well. Look at this, beautiful. The, the, uh, with the bundle, it 
works out that the palette works out at 11.24 pence and I love that pastel kind of that's rainbow. just beautiful that's creating your own linen your own uh, sort of pearlized card yeah but that has been stamped on with embossing ink and then heat embossed absolutely it hasn't bubbled it hasn't cracked there isn't it's almost neutral there is nothing there it's really weird but if you run your finger over one of those yeah. you don't actually feel anything absolutely. there's nothing no waxy residue nothing on the center and that was all made with white card yeah and then absolutely. through a stencil you've got the beautiful stars in the background absolutely and then the purple is actually made again from the mica magic indeed now of course if you want yours a uh, 42 pounds and 47 pence is your price uh now of course uh, that is with the doubles that's not a one day special which is just the two palettes but of course you have got both options uh, bottom of the screen for the one day special which is 26 pounds and 98 pence in there now we have got uh, the uh, happy hour deal which you may have found already because during this one day special uh, you are gonna have the possibility in every single hour to have uh, an happy hour which means that the price is lower but for this hour and this hour only we are talking uh, so the 6 p.m. happy hour did sell out very quickly so if you want yours make sure to check out your basket so we have in here uh, the abstract flower and the diastam set which is a phenomenal uh, bundle here and we have got them here one die one stamp but so many possibilities is, John. It is. What you've got in here is a background stamp. So you've got an A6 background stamp, which is on its own, beautiful with the flowers. Yeah. But you lay the die over and cut it out, it will give you a different flower again. Yeah. So it gives you a completely different flower. It cuts out half of the petals of them, which you can build up to make your own flowers. So it's a beautiful flower die on its own. Add it with the actual stamp and you've got a detailed stamped yeah. flower as well. Yeah. Or just use a stamp on it. So and you've got a beautiful background with that wood grain and text running across it. Indeed it is. Now, of course, if you want to go for this bundle, 223 629 is your item number. 999 is your price. Very busy for it. And nearly 20% of the stock has gone. With a £12 saving, is better than half price. So grab it while we have it in stock. Yeah, it is a happy hour deal, but there is no, conf no reassurance that it's going to last till the end of the hour. Then we have embossing folders. Now, of course, a perfect partner in crafting for the Mica Magic is the embossing folders. Now, in here is the Nelly Snellin, and you have got 40% of the stock has already gone. Time cogs and writing. £19.99 and pence is your price. Um, 917195 is your item number. Right, and uh, now... John, I mean, I would say it's a perfect marriage or a perfect partner it in crafting. Is. These, these are, I mean, I think Micro Magic is my hero product. It's the one that we developed. It's exclusive to craft artists. Nobody else does it, and I love it. Yeah. But having the right folders with it. And these are my folders of 2022. Oh. I absolutely adore these. You will see them popping up all over the thing, all over new no. products that I've got coming out because I've used them I in the samples. I love them. But just how detailed they are, because they're 3D. That script is just so, so useful and you need something. You know, when you've got yeah. a simple stamped image or a little flower or something, you need something. It just works for it. But with the Mica Magic, it, I just think it just makes it, it's magic with these. It is, absolutely. It really, really is. But I'm going to use the, the time one for my first demo. Wow. Just to show people absolutely. really why I love that one so much. Yeah. I've got right. a thing for clocks. <laughs> well, I know. Uh, <laughs> clocks are very, very fun to use as well. Uh, of course, you have them in here. I, I love that. Now, that technique i'm going to be showing you this at 8 a.m in the morning is the kaleido this is the kaleido so this is actually mica magic background which again you could do that with an ink and you could do wow. it with, an ink, with a gilding wax but you couldn't then foil on top so i'm going to be showing you in 8 a.m how you foil with an embossing folder using the kaleido and if you haven't got the kaleido this again is foiling the embossing folder in the kaleido which again i'm going to show you in first thing in the morning but I would say, oh, if you haven't got the Kaleido, Kaleido now. we have a really, right really limited stock of them oh. in. And when they've gone, that's it until the next order comes in, which could be six months. Okay. 
So I'm just yeah. warning because I know yeah, yeah, absolutely. I know how many we've Let's how do many we've got quick in. Let's do a flash of the Kaleido machine with the complete bundle machine and a starter kit, ink, magic medium pad, and the foil and rolls. And now, of course, you are saving ten pounds in here. Now you can flexi buy. Now this one has a ten pound saving, and this is a further ten pounds. So in actual fact, your saving is twenty pounds. You can split it also into three payments of forty nine pounds and ninety nine pence. Maybe you have always been thinking, I want a Kaleido coat and a collider now is the time because as you have heard john how well limited amount of them in there also once you make uh, the uh, put it in your baskets with that three flexi payment option you can put the one day special those new folders in there and flexi buy those ones as well into three interest free payments it comes in with plenty of accessories because it's the starter kit because it's worth 33 pounds 33 pence so that is 49 pounds and 99 pence to pay today especially if you are a freedom member that is your delivery cost for the first installment and of course it will be then posted uh, ASAP. now more embossing folders but these ones are a slightly different size and as well as different patterns i know I love that. Isn't it beautiful? It's just it so beautiful. Really, it really calls out to me. That's the flower at the bottom there that you've got on your bottom. Yeah. Well, it's bottom right on my screen, but I don't know if that means it's bottom left at uh, home. Uh, you know what? I'm, don't, don't, <laughs> don't mess with right and left. I just, I'm very challenged when it comes to right and left. Yeah, but it's just beautiful. It's a repeatable pattern, but that's so, it's almost Eastern. I really wanted, and I ran out of time, I wanted to make a box out of that in the Micro Magic because yeah. it would look like it was Absolutely. almost tooled leather. It's a beautiful folder. You're getting that one in A6, but you're also getting the bird, which I just think is so classic for, for sympathy cards, just on its own. Yeah. Just embossed onto the front of a card. A little bit of Micro Magic I've used there just to put a little bit of blue on the bluebird, a little bit of gold, or do it as a robin. Absolutely. Give him a little red breast yeah. again using the Micro. Just Indeed. beautiful. But then you're going to get the DLs. <gasps> I love the flowers, the 3D element, like kind of those different layers of depth. You have, you, you can see the flowers overtaking each other with the stars and the swirls. The stars actually pop out at you. They're not well, just flat yeah, like they always used to be. The 3Ds make such a big difference to the embossing folder. And again, with the flowers, it shows off the beautiful folder, um, but also shows off the Micro Magic because I've used the same colours on the white and the black. Yeah. And it just shows the difference you get depending on the colour that you're using, but how well they colour, but how that 3D folder really goes backwards. It is indeed. Uh, nearly a half the stock has gone, so if you want yours, do make sure to check out your baskets. Uh, now, uh, 109570 is your item number, £24.98. Very, very, very uh, uh, a great price on this one with a £9 saving. Just you're paying just £14.97. 048053 is your item number. Can you talk us through? Them, uh, John. Yeah, so you've got three classic designs that you will use constantly. So you've got the beautiful braided lines, which just run in again a continual yeah. pattern. You've also got the um, the blocks, the sort of square blocks, yeah. and then you've got this beautiful spiral flower. And you can see them behind each other because it's 3D and the leaves and everything in there. Again, that's just embossed into satin wow. card. I love it's that. It's just so nice. Again, these take the Micro Magic so so well. Yeah. Um, I've got one here, unfortunately, that <laughs> is, is at the wrong end from you that's been done where someone's actually just used the Micro Magic on it and it looks so beautiful. It does. You can see in there, you can just see how well that looks yeah. and how that 3D works and just really does it. So it's just a beautiful set of folders that you will use constantly. You'll see them through nearly all the samples from all of the angels and they're never told what to use in folders. Yeah. They so use what they want. I never, ever say to them, right, you've got to use these folders or this. I say, these are the new range, use what you want. Yeah. And you'll see them popping up time and that time and time again because they love them. I'm not surprised because they are absolutely stunning. And they are something that, you know, an embossing folder, you always want something that is going to be a perfect background to a multitude of occasions. Yes. You don't want something that's going to stand out so much that you can't see anything else. All you're actually seeing is the embossing <gasps> folder. Oh, we need to And again, that's for foiling the embossing folder well, in the Kaleido. You need to watch at 8 a.m. But of course, you can get your Kaleido now. I love these designs. 048053 is your item number. Saving nine pounds if you want yours. Do make sure to check out your baskets. We also have more for you. And of course, we have got you John next, but next door. Uh, now, this one is a pick and mix. And this one is a pick 
like a mix of a stanza. So you are getting four, but four for $9.99, which means that it's almost <laughs> half price because you are saving nine pounds and nine uh, ninety-seven. Uh, those did 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 I did oh, did I do something wrong? <laughs> oh, I, I just kind of no, I sounded like kind of a said. Uh, did I say a price wrong? Because I do get very like, oh, did I say something wrong? Uh, nine five zero five zero nine. Oh, that number. Yeah, I love that number. Anyway, you pick and choose any four of those uh, stencils in here. And, for, and you have them in there. So you have beautiful butterflies. I was supposed they coordinate with... They fit with my butterfly and dragonfly media plate. Okay, yeah. They also fit with my butterfly and dragonfly die. Okay. So they're exactly the same size as both the die and the media plate. Yeah. So they'll work perfectly with those and they will really tie in. Okay, fabulous. So if you want yours, uh, well, as I mentioned, almost half price, you are paying nine ninety nine. dollars uh, You're saving £9.97. and pence. nine is your item number. Then we have got the, the luggage tags, like I said, 10 dice in there for £9.99 and, pence and saving uh, £5, which is a fabulous saving if you think a third of the price. Now, John, these ones are clever tags as well. Um, I, I don't. I love these tags. They are, I mean, I'm not sure how to say this. These have sold out every time we've brought them yeah. on air, and we've rung and said, "Is there any more stock?" And there isn't. They have now finally gone through and counted, and this is the last of them. Yeah. And I love these. You've got a beautiful stitch detail all the way round. Yeah. They're not nested. Right. They've been kept in aspect ratio. Yeah. So that the smallest one is still the right tag. Okay. I use them for my Christmas tags. I have every single piece of card I've ever owned, more than five of, yeah. cut in one of these and on a big ring at home right. to use as my tags. I do it for the Christmas and glitter. But you've also got four photo corners. So you yeah. put those on and cut those, and that and they gives are, you I love the, the little design. slits yeah. mm -hmm. with the stitch detail the same to put your photos in or your yeah. vellum. You've got the little ring binders to control them and punch the hole out, right. and a little strip that you can actually put like little gift cards and things yeah. in. Um, but also with these, these will fit with the papers that were in my Christmas box kit yeah. from the end of last year and the box kit I did earlier last year. Right. So they will fit exactly with the papers and the tag designs that are in the box kit from last year as well. Well, they're fabulous. A 10 dies and everything that John designs is, of course, incredibly versatile and useful. And that great price of 9.99 for them, 271878 is your item number. You have got a massive discount in this hour, John. It's a phenomenal uh, savings there. And then we have got the alphabet, the bundle, the lowercase and alphabet, um, the punctuation die sets. Uh, now, this one, you have got a three pound saving, 90, 90, 18 pounds and 98 is your item number now can you talk us through about yeah, this so if we did my bold alphabet yes. and last year we brought it back right we brought it back and it sold out okay completely and when we brought it back we actually thought that the lower case was sold out yeah. that was the upper case we have found a small quantity of more Oh, so right. we have added them on along with the punctuation again, which is a die that sold out when we... It's only been on air once, yeah. both of them, and they sold out when we had them on air. Um, but these match exactly with my large, bold alphabet, which is the uppercase. So if you're wanting the lowercase, this fits exactly in size. And each letter is uh, based around an inch. Okay. So the uppercase is an inch, so the yeah. largest letters on this, like the L and the K, are an inch. The rest of them are like half an inch to yeah. fit exactly in scale. So this works exactly with the bold alphabet uppercase. Right, now of course if you want yours, a 428282 uh, is your item number. Now of course you have got, these ones are items and they are going to be featured, but the happy hour, very, very busy, better than half price, you are saving £12, incredible saver, uh, nearly a quarter gone for that, so if you want yours, make sure to check out your baskets, 223629 is your item number. And of course they are one day special, the start of the show, those beautiful Mica Magic palettes, the spring pastels and the winter jewels 30 colors in total brand new today they are supposed to be a 14 pounds and 99 pence each but they are actually now with part of the one day special with their three pounds um three pounds saving uh you are uh, th sorry i need your mask my uh, lottie as again because i'm 13 pounds and 39 49 pence Right, sorry, I'm just not going to say, I'm just 
You've done a lot of shows today, bless you. You have, really I have. have and I, come, I, think I am. You are tired, bless yeah, you. I am. Numbers as well. 737-300 uh, is your item number. Uh, but uh, yeah, true, true story. Not as many as Lottie has done. Uh, now, of course, we have got the Makeup Magic Spring Pastel and Winter Jewel with 40 dollars and case. And of course, with that £4.50 saving, which is, uh, you know, additional. So this works out at 11 24 pence per palette. And then the Dovers uh, are £19.99 on top of that. Right, back to you, John. OK, so I'm going to show a couple of things. Yes. So one of the first things I wanted to show is earlier. Um, so watch on. We'll be doing this again at 8am in the morning. Right. Sam yeah. will be back Ooh, to with do this razor. again live. So what we did was we put this into the mould. Yes. So we put this into the mould. And what I did was basically I just, just put the yeah. colour into the mould. Now, you know, if you've got... Um, <gasps> resin yes and you want to pour resin in if you want to put mica in you yeah. have to dust it in don't yeah. you yeah so it will go everywhere and it goes everywhere when you pour yeah. the um, resin in it starts yeah. to go out to everywhere. everywhere well this is exactly what i did and we'll, i will show you again live at eight o'clock yeah just like this i did that with this one yeah and we took it out but look at the back absolutely there is no transfer. none of it moves it stays yeah. exactly where it is but we haven't cleaned this mold or this mold Yes. This is what happened when these pieces came out. Right. So what we've got is fantastic. So we've now got a way to directionally colour yeah. our moulds for resin okay. or clay yeah. or paper clay or anything. But really, that's not it. I want to add a bit of shine on. Okay. Yeah. So what I can do is I can go into, let's say, this lovely gold colour and I can add on top. I can see, yeah. So hopefully you can see. If I go for this, go for that stripe there, can you see now yeah. how I can... There we go. I can How see, I get yeah. that gold or colours on top or other colours. I might say, do you know what? I'd like that to be a bit bluer. Well, there we go. Let's make those sides blue, shall we? So there are different ways of using it because, of course, if you put it first in the mould, it will go into the crav uh, into certain crevices, goes, like the deeper ones. It will go into the deeper ones. It will yeah. go into the fine points wherever you go. But that won't come off. That won't wash ah. off. So if I hold that one up, you can see how I've changed and amended the colour. It's incredible. But I can also take just a standard... So this has been done with white quickset yeah. resin. Sam did these while we were here tonight. So I'm going to take a dauber this time. Okay. I'm going to go with the tealy colour. And how I can now just dust over yeah. and colour that with the dauber. So now I can colour my resin. I see. But not just... And like you said, would you have a gilding wax that yeah. gives the shine... No. In that no, colour. No, that kind of shimmer and that no. beautiful luster. And I want to, so, but the centre of that would be yeah. yellow, wouldn't it? So let's yeah. put some yellow on. Yeah. To make some yellow. You know, with yeah. gilding wax, it would go quite, it goes blobby. It's yeah, six it, it in does. sections, it does. doesn't it? I know, it does. I know, bless Lottie said that, so yeah. I can't claim that one as mine. Yeah. But you can't, yeah. you can't keep layering like this. Yeah. So I can now start ah, to. I see. But if you, again, if you yeah. look at that carefully, can you Absolutely, see? Absolutely, yeah. There's absolutely yeah. no blobbing. And if I want it in those crevices, this is what's so amazing about it. When I use a brush, um. it goes to a powder. Okay. So I can actually start to brush that in yeah. to those finer points. Indeed. Or I can use a finer dauber. So that's on our resin. But if you, like me, you're a, you're a, you're a paper crafter. Yeah, I, I mean, am. I love yeah. these on my things. <laughs> Remember earlier, I was trying to show you the colours? Yes. And I was using my fingers yeah. on here. Yeah. This is where a dauber comes in. Right. Because I've not got much of a coverage. No, you don't, no. So I'm going to turn it over fresh side. Yeah. But this is where I can now, I'm going to use the um, winter set. The, the winter jewels. Using the dauber, yeah. I will get a lot stronger colours. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Colours. I, I will say, this is one of the occasions that in real life it's much stronger than on the screen. Oh, I forgot the overhead camera hey, yeah, doesn't, doesn't, point. Uh, there it is, doesn't show a lot. So I'm, yeah. I'm just going to, I'm, I'm literally making a mess and I'm trying Can you intensify by layering? So you, you can. do want, oh, I see. And that's what I'm going to actually do. Oh. So what I'm doing is, I'm mm. making a little bit of a mess. But if you notice, I don't know if you're yeah. seeing this, I'm using one dauber. Yeah. And I'm going between each colour. And if I go to the white now, right. it stays white. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't mix. Yeah. So I've just put literally 
a little bit on here and you think well you, you've made a real mess of that job yeah. i'll show you now look oh look at the sheen that. of that yeah and hold that one up you can see yeah okay like a firework but if this was gilding wax and i could do this with gilding okay, wax yeah. what i couldn't do yeah. is emboss this could i no because it could kind of uh, it will reactivate it, 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 the yeah. chemicals inside yeah. Right. And that's literally what happens, to make sure I've got it the right way. Because Mica Magic is neutral, yeah. I can now emboss this. Uh, after it has... After I've coloured right. it. Okay. So I'm just going to run this through. Now, the embossing sandwich for the 3D folders, yes. I've found, is if you've got a Kaleido, yeah. it's your base plate and the your 5 mil yeah. plate. Okay. If you've got the Go Power and Emboss, mm -hmm. it is the base plate and your B plate. Okay, yeah. And that's for all of the 3D folders on the show. Yeah. I've tested all oh, of them. Perfect. And it fits. That's, that's always one of those ones that I, you know, with 3D folders, it's always a, oh, which one it was. Everyone's so different. Every Absolutely. Yeah. So the Kaleido is the 5 mil and plate and, and the base. The Go and Power is the 5 mil and, and the B. base, or the B plate and the base. Yeah. So <coughs> any comp machine yeah. you've got, you're looking basically yeah. just to add, to have effectively yeah. a 5 mil sandwich plus okay. that. Yeah. So, but if anyone's been waiting for the 3 mil plates to come back in stock, they are back in stock. Oh, good. Today, first time. But look, so if this was gilding wax now, right. I know this would be sticky. Yeah. I know my folder would be covered okay in gilding wax yeah and look well, nothing, nothing not even a little not bit of even. shine but look none of that i'll hold it up there has wow. cracked off wow okay so, so it's now there. it's like almost like a pearlescent lesson card that you have a it boss. is so now what i can do is i can start to go right okay yeah. look what happens when you use it on embossed card yeah and this is what's so amazing yeah. about Mica Magic and you can see why I love the time one. Right, yeah, I, I do as well. It's just such a, it's a great one. It's like time to meet, you know, have time for tea, let's have a little afternoon together, you know, kind of that sort it of... It is, it, depending yeah. on which way you do it, it can be masculine or yeah. feminine because everyone says, oh, well, look, aren't they quite feminine? Aren't they, yeah. quite, ma aren't they quite masculine, those ones? Yeah. So I'm going in with those and scrubbing in, right, okay. Yeah. So that's kind of intensified yeah. my background. Now I go in with my finger. All uh, right, okay? yeah. And this is where I really start to get yeah. the directional. Absolutely. So I really yeah. start to get more. Ah, oh, and then you can highlight those designs. So this is where I can highlight in the up. same way that I would if I was using a gilding wax. But if I go right, so let's go all the way around this clock here. Yeah. So I'm going to go all the way around this clock here with gold. I'm going to put a second yeah. coating on it so it's very gold. And I yeah. go, I don't like that. Yeah. Again, overhead, okay, see how? Yeah. Okay. I don't like that. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I, I want it silver. Well, I'll go with silver. Now, what happens if you put silver gilding wax over gold? Uh, well, it's, it's just kind of, it's kind of becomes a little greyish now. You get mud. Mud, mud. Yeah, muddish. No, you don't. It turns it to silver. Oh, wow. So now, that's silver. Wow. Because Mica Magic, if I'm not happy with it, I'm not happy with that red there, yeah, I'll, I'll take that white. And so then they, they layer perfectly over the top. And you're building. So, and the, the colours underneath doesn't matter that doesn't much. Doesn't matter in the slightest. Because of the concentration of Mica, it is Mica mixed yeah. with pigment. Okay. So it's Mica mixed in with, with a pigment. The Mica creates yeah. a barrier and so the pigment colour yeah. shines through it. So the light affects it. So I want to start to make the things look, I mean, I'm hoping yeah. this green, you're yeah. going to look at that and you're going to go, John, you're making yeah. a real sow's ear of that one. Okay. But we can turn it into the silk purse because I can start to then... I see. I can work over and it starts to look, let's go in with a coppery rose, it starts to look as if it's verdigris. It is, actually. I can work it in. I see. And then let's finish that bit off. And when I'm finished and I hold that one up, yeah. I think you'll see better in that color. <gasps> wow. That's, and uh, we can see even hints of colors. If you wanted to kind of completely obliterate them, you could. But I like how you have left a little bit of green coming through in certain areas. So, so it's, it's one of those ones that we have got to control. You have got total control. I mean, I'm looking at that and going, well, do you know, it's, very, it's far too light on the edges. Yeah. Well, let's just take some of the red yeah. 
and I'll really work some of that in and some of the copper. Some of the magic, work that and magic in. And I'll work in. the magic into there yeah. and then we go. But you can just keep yeah. working. As you see now, when I hold, up, hold it up, you'll see this edge here. Absolutely. Suddenly, it's, it's like a sheet of metal. It is. But Absolutely. All that sheen and shine, all that detail shows. And again, I wouldn't have that many colours yeah. of gilding really whites open. Right. You wouldn't. Yeah. And again, I've been hammering this, and look at it. It's all still there. It's a quick brush over with a light brush, with a, with a light brush or like a blending brush yeah. to get rid of any excess. Yeah. And it's back to normal. Absolutely, it is back to normal. And of course, that is included in the one-day special or the complete collection, which comes in with the Dovers, which of course, what uh, John recommends. Uh, that is now half the stock gone, the one with the complete with the case and the Dovers. Over half the stock now gone for that one. Remember, the one-day special uh, is just for the two pounds. It has got a three pound savings, which is carried forward for the bigger bundle. However, uh, half the stock as well gone for just the palace on their own. Maybe Maybe you have got the dovers already but if you don't please make sure that you go for the one the bigger one because then of course the, the dovers uh, helps you out you can buy individuals so for instance if you just say well i'm a pastel person i just want the spring pastel or maybe i'm a winter jewel maybe what jewel are you anyway uh 14 pounds and 99 pence is the price for a single one but in the one day special they work out at 13 pounds and uh, 14 pounds Okay, I forgot the pennies. Anyway, but of course, if you want to save even more, the complete collection, when you take out the 19 pounds and 99 pence from the, uh, the, uh, the, 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 the Dovers, it works out at 11 pounds and 94 pence per pallet. 24, sorry. Um, six to eight, triple three is the one that comes with the Dovers. Right, back to you, John. Okay, so what I've got here is this is a, um, again, I think it's a resin piece that's been yeah, cast by absolutely. Ali Reeve. Yeah. So it's one of the um, pieces that I've watched. And all I've yes. done is, because it's in a bronzy gold yep. colour, I've just gessoed it in black. Perfect. Yep. But again, so this is a piece. I want to do something to set on there. Brilliant. So all I have to do is it's literally, if I want to, first of all, I'm going to make this silver. Yeah. Straight away. Okay. Pick yeah. it up again. But if I was using gilding wax, that's almost the end. I can yeah. start to add a little bit more onto it, but what I can't do, yeah. it's just picked up those top bits, hasn't right, it? Right, yeah. So that actually now looks a little bit clockwork, so I can go in, but I can go in with this tawny colour okay. and start to do that. I can age it with a little bit of green or verdigris, a little bit of red to show some yeah. rust. It's funny, but when I'm trying yeah. to do something aged, I will always use a true red. Uh, really? Yeah, because... It actually, red, make, red, you know when they're making picture frames, yes. they always paint them red before they gild them oh, to make the gold shine. Oh, I see. So when something ages and when you're actually yeah. looking at an aged picture frame or an aged watch or something that's been gilded, invariably it's been painted red, red. first and the red starts to show through Indeed. a little bit. Yep. And that's what helps get things a little bit more natural. Yep. So you can see there, I've started to pick that up really yep. easy, all covered. But, yeah, fair enough. Yeah. I could do that bit probably with gilding wax. Absolutely. But what I couldn't do mm. is what do I do about yeah. these bits? Yeah. What do I do about these flat bits here? Well, this time I use a little fine brush. And you can go in there. And look, I can work that. So now suddenly that Absolutely, back of yeah. that, look, is silver. That is, yeah. So I can work those in and those go, right, magic let's have a little bit of red. That, yeah. yeah. And that's the difference. I, this would be just be gloopy if I actually tried to do yeah. it with a polish or a wax or a liquid product because it's a liquid, but it's not, it's a powder, yeah. but it's got a binder, so it's... Yeah. That's why we called it Mica Magic. It is. Yeah. Because we really felt... That it is a that magical magic. medium. Yeah. yeah, when we came up with it, and it's, it's yeah. our product that we developed. It's not one that we bought off... Um, uh, yeah, um, ready made. Ready made. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, you develop you know, it. Yeah. Yeah, but not, not only that, we chose the colours. Yeah. These are the charts. Yeah. I'll hold them up actually this time. Yeah, you can Sam see. Sam and I sat at our kitchen table. Yeah. And we picked these two. Yeah. From Fabulous all stuff. of the colours available. Yeah. They go pigments. And we they? put it together from about four hundred different colours wow. to make sure nothing matched. But you see now when I turn that round, yeah. exactly how 
That's old metal. Yeah, it is. But it's not. It was a blank resin piece that started out yeah. like that. Wow, well, we'll in front of us. And then but we've got into everywhere, but nothing's clogged. No. I'm just going to do the edge while you... Do what you've got yeah, to do next. absolutely. Right, of course, if you want them, uh, we have uh, different options. So the one with the uh, Dovers and the one with the one day special, just the palettes. We have had a question from Sue, and it, you know she wants to uh, think about coloring a stamp image with the Mica Magic. How would we do that? Right. Well, what you can do is you've got two options. The first one is if you've got quite a heavy one. Yeah. So let's let's take honestly, I have a piece here. So. First thing you can do is, what I've done here is, I've stamped the stamp. Yeah. Yeah. So I've stamped the stamp in clear embossing ink right. and I've left it overnight. Yeah. So I've almost got a watermark yeah. that I can't see. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to go with the pastels. So what you can do, Sue, you can do it like this. And you'll notice what it's doing is, it's picking up more where the colour is. Okay. I always, it never shows up well on the overhead on this. And then... Always works. I always do this on vellum. Oh, but but I stuck. love that. What happens is it gets dark. Get darker. Where the colour is. Yeah, there, yeah. I don't know if you can actually see it. It's not coming across very well, unfortunately. And uh, there it is a little bit. Maybe this is the one I did earlier, yeah. which will show you a little bit better. It does show <laughs> a little bit. Sometimes live TV is just kind of if you. I don't know what happens. It kind of goes. <laughs> yeah. The other thing you can do is to use smaller daubers, so of you course. could stamp yeah. an image, which I bet I don't have one. Uh, but you could. Oh, let's see. This one I was doing earlier. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So if I want to, I can go in with a brush, yeah. exactly the same, or use the teeny tiny daubers that we do. Uh, absolutely, yeah. Maybe a paper stamp or, or, you or a cotton bud. Or use a paper bud. stump. Anything just to pick up cotton bud. Or yeah. you can get, I know um, Janet, um, a friend of mine, used to do workshops for... Um, she used, do you remember the little eyeshadow? Yes, paddles? yes, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Work Those ones well. work so well. So yeah. anything small just to apply yeah. it on, but I'm just applying it here yeah. directly on to those. So I'm starting to colour those yeah. in. If I want to add a bit more green, yeah. then I can add some more green in or whatever else. But yeah, just go through like that. Yeah. Just find something small that will apply it on. Quick spray of really cheap hairspray and it will set it. Indeed it will. Now of course £42 and £47 is for the one that comes with the Dovers included and the Tia uh, palettes. Now of course that has got a £4.50 sa £4 saving but that's including, uh, then it carries forward the one from the One Day Special. So it actually that saving is £3 and additional you have got £4.50 saving. So it is uh, a really good got bundle to that. The happy hour uh, that finishes in 20 20, well, actually less than that, to 18 minutes. Uh, now, of course, it, it's £12 saving, 9.99 is your price. If you want yours, do make sure to check out your baskets. 223 629 is your item number for them. Uh, remember, uh, this is not the, like kind of the one day special, the deal will last uh, 24 hours as long as the stock. But if you, the one day special, uh, the, the happy hour will finish at the end of this hour. Now, we have got also. The luggage tie, the tag die, very busy for that with a five pound saving. It's just nine pounds and nine ninety nine pence. Two seven one eight seven eight is your item number. And we also have got a collider, the machine that of course John lo you know loves, and of course that is has a ten pound saving. Now this one is just a machine with the pen and the foil, uh, but that has also three pay three interest free payments at thirty three pence, uh, thirty three pounds and 33 pence however that 10 pound saving carries forward to the starter kit and then additional you have got a 10 pound saving now that means that you still kind of split the cost but of course you have got in there the ink the reinkable pad you have got lots more foil and of course you have got also the magic medium now that means that you have got a 20 pound saving because the 10 pound saving from the machine carries forward and you can participate today 49 pounds and 99 pence if you are flexible 
sign and that's the, your first payment. Now, if you want to add your mic and magic into that, uh, of course, you can flex it by into three payments. It means that the um, mic and magic uh, bundle with the Dovers will be, you just be paying 14 pounds, 16 pence. That's how much you would be paying if you split it in your first payment. And then of course you have got the same amount next month interest free. Now back to you, John. Okay, so what I've done this time is just on white yeah. and I've embossed the spiral flower because that just works so, so well. So again, hopefully, there we go. I hold it at that angle, you see the pattern. When I hold it up like that, you see nothing because it's white. Oh, you do, virtually. Yeah, yeah we do. It's really quite strange. But again, yeah. the Mica Magic, if I wanted to colour this in different colours and yeah. different shades, I would normally go to ink and I would use a finger door, but I'm not going to say so. Let's say I wanted to use... Um, what I would actually do is I would look to use on this, say Versafine Claire. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Versafine, yeah. So I would want to put, um, so it would be pink. So yeah. let's go for a pink. Okay. Okay. But straight away, that's pink, just as it would be if I used an ink. Yeah. But yeah. he's also shiny. Okay. Shiny. So it's also gilded and pearlized. So let's go with a pink there and we'll go with another pink rose there. Okay. And the more you add, and it's always better to do this with the daubers, the more you add, then the deeper the colour will get because you can layer it Absolutely. up. So it's one of those you can always add but you can't take away. But with Mica Magic, you almost can. Because I can go, right, okay, so I've gone them a nice pink. But realistically, if that was a pink rose or a pink flower, it would be darker on the top bits, yeah. wouldn't it? So I'm going to go in with my finger to the red and then oh i love it the def, you know it kind of it adds that depth into that color suddenly that's yeah. going back isn't it it is so you can see there when i shine that yeah you've got that rose but you've got the d deeper red and if i put another coat on yeah. it gets darker and so let's go now with um a yellow. Oh, yellow, like that. So yellow rose. Yeah, oh, yellow. What's your, your favourite colour of roses then? White. What? Mm, like white roses, yeah. White, unfortunately. Yeah. yeah. White roses. Mm. Um, red roses uh, mean lust, Oh. not love. Oh, so I, I like lust, not love. Yeah. That maybe we need to roses, change that. I, I, it's hilarious. Yeah, red roses, I did once look into, I did a collection a lot of years ago called The Language of Flowers. So I yeah. looked into the old Victorian language of oh. flowers. And I found that, um, is it that red roses meant lust? Um, white avoiding. roses meant eternal love, I believe, but I can't yeah. quite from oh, right. Finally, yeah. Yellow yeah. roses. It's friendship. No, cowardice. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. That's funnily enough, I have got in my tights, uh, you know, in, uh, in, in here, uh, my, my tights, one of the, uh, Cer um, is Cervantes, uh, the writer of El Quixote, and says uh, that basically love and lust are not the same thing. Sometimes you lust over things that you don't love. Sometimes you love things that you don't lust over. Yeah. No. And so therefore, right. it's just, I, I like that. that. Red roses is lust and... Oh, I, do you know, to be fair, I love them both. Red do, roses and white. Deep, deep red yeah. roses. So I've gone over there. The dark ones, yeah. They're, they're really the dark, dark yeah. intense crimson. Yeah. But I've gone over the green there. Yeah. yeah. So I'm just going to finish off with... Um, I'll tell you what, let's finish off with a light pink. I used a lighter pink. I'm just going to yeah. fill in the rest of this. I've not added any more colour yeah. on this. So it's a bit like when you're inking. But the thing is, I've got no inky fingers. Yeah. I've got no ink that's going to last for ages. But again, those yellow roses, they need a little bit on the tip, don't they? So I'm going to go in with this little bit of copper. Yeah. Again, oh. just to add that yeah. little bit of 3D. Yeah. So you can see there, because I can layer it up, I can go, I did these lighter ones here. So let's okay. say they're going on an almost lilac. So let's add a little bit of purpley lilac to it. But this is the difference. If I was using, and no effect, you know I love my inks. Yes, you, you know do, I do. You do. But I couldn't do this or no, achieve this no. with ink. And there is a softness. There is a kind of almost ethereal nature to this. It's just kind of, it's both the colours layering on top, layer after layer, but it, it's that luster, that kind of pearl into it, but also 
It's almost like, you know, when you have got this diffused light into things and, you know, it's just softness. So it's just love that. So I can add a little bit of green onto there. Yeah. And then I'm just going to take my finger of whatever colour and just kind of smoosh it. Yeah. Which, again, this would make a real mess if I'm using wet inks. Yeah, absolutely. So I'm just smoothing it over. Let's give it a polish off. But I hold this one up now to the, to the main camera. You'll be able to see. Wow. Oops, hang on. All that beautiful. Uh, and it's, and uh, also, <coughs> this sort of shine, it's impossible to get it in a, in a paper pad that's you, you, already yeah, made. Yeah, you couldn't get a print done no. like that. You couldn't get that sheen and that shine, that texture in that any, any other way. And the only other way you could do it is gilding wax. Absolutely, yeah. But with gilding wax, that would be very heavy and gloopy. Yeah. And to be honest, the colours sometimes don't run yeah. over the top of each other like that. Because I can actually turn around now and go, do you know yeah. what? Yeah. That, I think that yellow flower there is yeah. too bright. OK. So I'm going to go into the white. Right. And I'm going to take it down. Oh, and then, yeah, you soften it. Because of the mica, white doesn't white out things. Yeah. But now suddenly, look. Yeah. It just it's softens softer. the yellow in there. Yeah. And suddenly it, now, that's behind the other yellow because yeah. it's softer. Yeah, it is. It, I know Pano has made it. And I, what I love about it is that it doesn't make it blotchy or layered. It's just that the layers are there. Sorry, the layered is not the word. Um, what I mean is it doesn't look overworked. No, it doesn't. Yeah. Um, and all I would say is if you want to, if you've got a few little bits that you think a bit yeah. too much, just... Soft brush. I used to use my mum's yeah. blusher brush yeah. to take the excess wow, off. My yeah. mum's old blusher brush. Yeah. Um, but I just literally polish it off. But can you see again? Yeah. It's not coming off massively. And if I want to seal it, seal it, because I'm really concerned it's just literally 99p plus a penny, yeah. two cans. Yeah. Hairspray. And that's Not a very, these with yeah. conditioners, all no, these no, posh no, no, ones, no. the cheapest lacquer you can get. Because that would be the best one because it doesn't have the oils, right? It doesn't have any of the oils or anything won't affect it and it will just seal it all yeah. completely off. And to be honest, that's the top trade as well that my dad, who is a fine artist, will recommend as well. Even, even yeah. for the expensive, it's like, no, nope, just use, use the cheapest uh, hairspray that you can, you can get. Yeah, and her dad does beautiful paintings. Oh, I have seen think, a couple in yeah. real life now and they are stunning. Oh, thank you. Not as cute, cute as the cats. Oh, yeah, you have met the kittens. I have met the kittens. The kittens. You very have lucky. indeed. And now, of course, the One Day is special. It contains those beautiful brand new palettes, the Mica Magic. Now, over half the stock has gone. And if you want yours, you're getting those 30 beautiful colours, the Spring Pastels and the Winter Jewels. Now, they, the One Day Special has a £3 saving, or you can go for the individuals. Now, the individuals are £14.99. However, in the One Day Special, £13.49, that's what in the One Day Special. However, if you choose, if you need more dollars, then this bundle is perfect. I would go for it because that way you can have one for each color because it has got 40 dollars. Now, if you go for that one, includes the uh, dollars with the 40, uh, the, the case with for 19 pounds and 99 pence so if you take that off the price with the palettes they work out 11 pounds and 24 pence and that's why we are approaching 60 percent of the stock of this bundle now that's because you have got an additional saving so the car the individual saving of the one day special carries forward and additionally you have got that saving so if you want that uh, dollar so you can have this perfect effects make sure to check out your basket six two eight triple three is your item number now John the thing is that this is one of those materials uh, those those mediums that it will work with vellum you have shown a uh, wood uh, MDF it will work with vellum wood MDF concrete stone gessamite um, plastics for resin. some reason it should not work on um, resin but Absolutely. it does because it's a high. If I give you that piece, yeah, you I feel how shiny. Wow! So I can <laughs> show you the back of it. This is resin. This is the quick dry resin from Eunice that yeah. you get that we bought here on yeah. the craft store. But that's a plastic. It should not. Yeah, that's this clear. Work on and there. look at this. But it will work on. You can take bits of it out and mix it in with um, heavy so. body gel medium. Yeah. And put it through your stencils wow. or put it through things like that. I mean, there's a, the book there is actually got yes. all of the gold um, floral mm. fantasia on that is gold mica magic from the palette mixed in with wow. heavy body medium. 
art angel you are an artist uh, she you is can an say. artist look, she is say an beautiful gem. edge and yeah she's a gem as well uh, now of course if you want yours make sure to check out your baskets now we have got one item that we you need to check out your baskets right now because we have got less than five, well about seven minutes till the end of this hour and that means that you have got that much to check out your baskets for the happy hour die and a stamp with a 12 pound saving better than half price 9.99 is your price 223629 is your item number brilliant I love that the distress look in here. I, love the one step stamp, one step die. I, I love this. It works so, so well. I mean, I think the samples are actually down in a box right at the other end. Oh, yes. I'm going to um, go but, and grab um, it. So I have to waffle for two minutes while, while um, Paula goes underneath the, the desk. Sorry. But you have got that beautiful, uh, beautiful flower that just cuts out so, so easily. Um, and can give you some really amazing effects. It really right, is so worth sort of seeing. Look at that gorgeous. What you can do. Element. So that's just colouring in the background as a stamp and then cutting out the individual petals and using them to make the flowers. Yeah. They will give you something different every single time. Absolutely, it is. Da fabulous, darling. Fabulous da uh, shot, darling. <laughs> I'll tell you to mark is there. Fabulous, uh, you know, samples as well. Fabulous, uh, uh, happy hour. So if you want your happy hour, make sure to check out your baskets. You are getting a £12 saving uh, for another five minutes, but do not miss out. So do check out your baskets for the one day, uh, the happy hour. But also ha check out your baskets for the one day special. Now, the one day special, of course, you have got the two months like a magic uh, palette with the new colors with that three pounds saving that's the one day special uh, which is at the end at the bottom of the screen however you need those dollars don't you maybe you are like you know a john and myself that you want a dollar for each color and of course that will give you the 40 dollars so you will have 10 extra that you can then mix create or something mix uh, now that has an additional four pounds and 50 pence which means that you i think you pay basically uh, for the palettes 11 pounds and 24 pence for the palace because the the case with the 40 uh 40 dovers is worth 19 pounds and 99 pence we also have got a kaleido um on the show which of course the machine itself comes with a 10 pound saving that is carried forward and with the additional um you have got a 10 pound saving and of course for the starter kit with 10 foils the starter kit with the ink the magic medium and so on and then of course you have that flexi buy with 49 pounds and 99 pence right uh, John, we will see you tomorrow at 8 a.m. We will, yes, and I will be doing, I will be showing you how to foil and gild with the Mica Magic Can, through the Collider. Cannot wait. An embossing wait. folder and also doing some more of the resin again well, for anyone who missed I that. I cannot wait. Thank you so much, thank John. You. It's always a pleasure to see you and Sam as well because that's that's always a treat as well. Uh, thank you so much for bringing such a beautiful uh, palette of colours and versatile and also for making sure that everything works across the ranges. Even things that you do not bring here uh, still will work. Yeah, that's what we always try and do is make sure everything we bring works with what you've got at home. Thank you so much, John. I'll see you once they after 8 p.m. Stay tuned for more here at the craft store.